Pikachu and Friends in Story Time. It was the night before Christmas. All the children were in Choo Choo's house. Cha Cha, Chica, and Cusley were helping make Christmas goodies. We're helping decorate the tree. Yay! And Baby Taku, Baby Kucha, and Baby Lucy were getting ready for Santa Claus. To come soon. I hope he remembers to get our presents. I hope we get to hear him laugh and say, Ho, ho, ho! Suddenly, the babies heard someone at the door. Here, but he's left some presents. They are for Cha Cha, Chica, and Cusley. Gotten you? I'm sure he'll come back soon with presents for us all. After some time, the doorbell rang again. Go to the fireplace. Come on, let's go. Oh, look, these presents are for us, Chiku. <laughs> Santa must have left them here. for us, or Champ either. Mr. Harlow! Hi, 
Hi, kids. Yes, it's me. But there's someone else with me, too. Ta-da! Santa! Yay! <laughs> ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas, kids! Merry Christmas, babies! I didn't forget you. Thank you. Come on, let's go eat the goodies you've made. Mmm, yummy. Yum, yum. Baby Taku, Baby Lucy, Baby Kucha, Choo Choo, and the others had a wonderful time that night. And the best Christmas with Santa Claus and Mr. Harlow. Merry Christmas, everyone! Christmas. I love decorating the Christmas tree and helping Mommy bake Christmas cakes. But you know what my favorite thing about Christmas is? Getting presents! I love getting Christmas presents. So stick around with us. Don't you want to see what presents Taku, Cha-Cha, and I get? looks so beautiful! It sure does! Hey, Choo Choo and Taku! What would you really, really like to get as a Christmas gift? Dino! Big Pig Baby! Wanna Dino? That's so sweet! Pika Pooka Paku! My baby brother Taku! I hope you get a cuddly dinosaur this Christmas. How about you, Choo Choo? Um, you know what I'd really love? Is a shiny new piano. Choo Choo, I hope your wish for a brand new piano comes true. And you, Cha Cha? What gift are you dreaming of? What I really, really would love is a big red race car toy! I hope you get the present you're dreaming of, Cha-Cha. It's such fun thinking about Christmas presents. Hey, kids. What do you say we go out and have some fun in the snow? Yes! yes! Daddy, can we ride our bicycles? Sure, darling. Let's go! Yay! This is fun! Hi, Mr. Roberts! Merry Christmas, Mr. Roberts! Hi, kids! Merry Christmas to you, too! Nice bikes! Thanks, Mr. Roberts! Actually, that's exactly the kind of bike I wanted to get for my little boy this Christmas. Hope you managed to get it, Mr. Roberts. Whoa! 
Well, actually, no. I didn't manage to save enough money for it. Maybe next Christmas I'll get it for him. Bye-bye! All right, then. Should we go inside and decorate our Christmas tree? Yes, Daddy! Be yes, Dada! Who could that be? Kids, it's Santa! Christmas, my dear children! Do you have any Christmas wishes? Is there anything you really want this Christmas? Yes, we do, Santa! Well, I'm going to sit here in this chair, and you can come up to me one by one and whisper in my ear and tell me what you want. Thank you, Santa! You can go first, Baby Taku. <laughs> you next, Cha-Cha. Your turn, Choo-Choo. This is amazing! Mr. and Mrs. Charlie, all three of your kids wished for exactly the same thing. You mean you also asked for... Really? But they like such different things. How's that even possible? That's because they're very kind and generous kids. And they understand the true meaning of Christmas. Go ahead, kids. Tell your parents what you really, really want this Christmas. Well, Mommy, Daddy, we heard Mr. Roberts telling Daddy that he couldn't save enough money to buy a bicycle for his little boy. And when we heard that, we knew that the thing that would make us really happy is if Mr. Robert's little boy could have a bike. And so we told Santa that we didn't really want anything for ourselves. What we really, really want this Christmas is for Mr. Robert's boy to get a bicycle. Aw, you adorable sweethearts. What kind hearts you have. That's true Christmas spirit, Choo Choo, Cha Cha, and Taku. We're so proud of you. And your Christmas wish will come true, dear kids. Merry Christmas! Our Christmas wish did come true. And we learned that making someone else happy can make you happy too. Merry Christmas, everyone! Hope you bring joy to someone this Christmas. Look! It snowed last night while we were sleeping. Doesn't it look beautiful? I just love snowy days. And guess what? Our friends Chiku, Chica, and Cusley are coming over soon. And we plan to make a snowman together out in the yard. Oh, the doorbell! That must be them. Come on! Come with us to play in the snow. <laughs> Our snowball's huge! Wow! That's nothing! Ours is bigger! And better! Cause I'm making it! And as you know, I'm the best at everything! Oh, oh Hussie. Hussie. Should we put our snowman together now? Yes, yes, let's do that! Are too 
short. How can our snowman have short arms? Hang on, I'll go look for longer twigs. What would you guys do without me? You're so lucky to have a friend who's the best at everything. Uh, a monster! Mo mo monster! There's a huge monster somewhere in the yard! Ah! Calm down, Cusley. There's no such thing as monsters. Monsters aren't real. Oh, yeah? Then how do you explain the huge monster tracks in the snow over there? Monster tracks? Show us where. I'm sure there's an explanation for them. Follow me! Um, no. I'll follow you. What did I tell you? Only a big, heavy monster could have such big feet. Husley, what if it's a snow monster that catches only the smartest and the greatest kids? Uh, we're so lucky to have a friend who's the best, best everything. The best even at screaming. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, relax, Cusley. Monsters aren't real. Let's follow the tracks and see where they lead and try and solve the mystery. D -d do we have to do? It's in there. The snow monster's hiding in the shed. Let's run. No, Cusley. We don't need to do that. Because monsters aren't real. <gasps> oh, that's a snow monster bellowing. And he sounds angry. Let's go meet the snow monster. Mr. Charlie, beware, th th there's a snow monster in this shed with huge feet and a loud, angry bellow. We followed his huge footprints and they led here. Um, Cusley? You mean huge feet like these? And an angry bellow like this? Huh? Cusley, I'm so sorry to disappoint you. But I think I'm the angry snow monster that you're scared of. My snow boots made these monster tracks. And the horn of my snowmobile is the monster's bellow. Oh, Mr. Charlie, I'm so glad that you're the snow monster. <laughs> but I'm glad you kids found me. I was just gonna come look for you and take you for a joyride. A joyride in the snow, Daddy? Yes, in my snowmobile. The horn wasn't working, so I fixed it here in the shed. And now that I fixed it, I'm ready to go whenever you are. We're ready! Let's go! Hop on, kids! Let's have some fun! The joyride! Thanks, Daddy! Thank, Thank you, you, Mr. Charlie. Charlie! Hey, I have an idea! Should we sing our snowy day song as we ride along? Yes! yes.
enjoyed the snowy day with me and my friends. Come back again soon! Can I tell you a secret? Today's my mommy's birthday! And Cha-Cha, Taku, and I have a surprise for her. We're gonna bake a cake for her. The best cake in the world! Come, watch how we do it. But shh, be very quiet. We don't want to wake mommy up. Cha-Cha, Taku, wake up! Do you remember what day it is? It's mom! Oh, oops! It's mommy's birthday! <laughs> Come on then, let's go bake the best cake in the world! For the best mommy in the world! Yippee! Daddy's gonna help us bake the best cake in the world! Thanks, Daddy! Let's get started, kids! We want to get it ready before Mommy wakes up, don't we? <laughs> so, what shape should the cake be? This one, Daddy! Okay! Let's get down to work. Choo Choo and Cha Cha, would you like to make the cake batter while I help Taku with the frosting? Yes, Daddy! Should we add a little pink to the batter? That's a great idea. She'd love that, Choo Choo. I've got this. A few drops. Uh-oh. I'm sorry. That's too much color. I think I just ruined the best cake in the world. Oh, Cha-Cha. Don't feel bad about it. It was a mistake. Come on. Cheer up, Cha-Cha. We'll still bake the best cake in the world. Daddy, I think we're ready to put this in the oven. Sure, darling. And now, we wait for a bit. Wow! And now for the most fun part, the frosting! See that, Taku? There's plenty left. I'm sure I'll manage to cover the whole cake. I've ruined it! It's not heart-shaped anymore! This was supposed to be a perfect cake, but everything's gone wrong! Color! The shape, the frosting, nothing's worked out. Choo Choo, don't cry, please. Daddy, this cake doesn't look that great. Can we please drive down to the cake shop and buy a nice one for Mommy instead? Aw, uh, Choo Choo, I can understand that you're feeling disappointed because the cake didn't turn out the way that you wanted. But let me tell you something. 
I've been watching the three of you, and I saw the love that you put into this cake. That's the magic ingredient, Choo Choo. That's what'll make it the best cake in the world. But it looks so, so wobbly. Choo Choo, I want you to think of something. Think of Mommy's treasure box. What does she keep in there? wobbly pictures we drew for her from the time we were babies. Exactly! And that's why I'm pretty sure that Mommy would prefer something that the three of you made rather than something that anyone can buy in a store. That's right, Daddy. Mommy loves the things we make her, even if they look kind of wobbly. Okay, come on! Let's take this to mommy! Surprise! Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, mommy! <laughs> Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! We baked this for you, mommy! Aw, that's so sweet, kids! What a lovely surprise! Thank you, my darlings! Good. It's great, kids. I love it. You know why I love this cake so much? It's because I can feel the thoughtfulness that went into it. And I can taste the love that three little pairs of hands poured into it. For me, it's the best cake in the world. Okay, honey. It's just my back. It kind of hurts. All that bending and twisting from cleaning the car has made my back sore. Aw, oh, honey. Maybe it's time we got you that car vacuum cleaner. Um, not yet. It cost a fair bit of money. And there are other important things we need to save up for right now. <laughs> what took you so long? Huh? What happened? Why do you look so sad, Choo Choo? I just overheard Mommy and Daddy talking. Daddy's back hurts. Oh no! Why? because of how much he has to bend while cleaning the car. He needs a car vacuum cleaner. But I heard Daddy say that right now there isn't enough money for it. Idea! We could help! You know those jars in which we've saved our pocket money? Let's give those to Mommy to buy a car vacuum cleaner with. Great idea! Let's go! Pocket 
money we've saved. We can use it to buy a car vacuum for Daddy. We know his back hurts. We heard you talking. He really needs one. Aw, you adorable sweethearts. You're such kind and generous kids. So, can we go to the store and buy one right away? Oh, darlings. It's so sweet of you to offer all your saved pocket money. But I'm afraid it won't be enough for a car vacuum cleaner. But don't you worry. We can make this work. You see, I've got some money saved up too for a vacuum for Daddy. We can add your pocket money to this. And let's see. We need just a little bit more. And here's a plan. Father's Day is just a few days away. Now, if you both can save a little more and fill up your jars in the next few days, we'll have enough to buy the vacuum cleaner and give it to Daddy as a Father's Day gift. That's a great plan, Mommy. We can do that, right, Cha-Cha? Yes, we can. Great. Gift money Grandpa gave us today. The little reward that Mr. Williams gave me for helping him rake his garden. What Cusley's mommy gave me for helping carry her groceries out of the car. What Mrs. Williams gave us for babysitting Kucha while she did her video call. Well done, Choo Choo and Cha Cha. Keep going. Wow! I want a chocolate cone with sprinkles. Maybe I could take some money out of my jar. But if I spend some of the saved money on ice cream, there won't be enough for Daddy's gift. Buying an ice cream is not as important as buying Daddy's gift. All right! You kids did it! You've managed to save what we need for Daddy's gift. Tomorrow's Father's Day. We'll go to the store first thing in the morning and buy the gift. Right, Mommy? That's right, kids. Tomorrow's the day. Yippee! I'll get it! Hey, Cha-Cha. Look what I just bought from the toy store with my pocket money. Wow! That's so cool! Whoa! A convertible! Hey! I want one too! I've got a lot of pocket money saved up! Mommy! Cusley just got a super cool toy car! It goes really fast! And you know what? The top opens up! Mommy, can I use some of that saved money to get a car like that? <laughs> wow! That sounds like quite an awesome car, Cha-Cha! And of course, you can have your saved pocket money. But remember, money once spent is gone. And maybe we won't be able to buy Daddy's gift tomorrow. Gone? Huh? No gift for Daddy! But 
We've been saving up just for that all these days. I'm going to stick with the plan. I'm going to hold on to the saved money for Daddy's gift, Mommy. Excellent decision, Cha-Cha. Huh? Happy Father's Day! Whoa! Happy Father's Day! Ah, thank you! This is such a wonderful surprise! But how did you manage this? You'll be proud to know, honey, that Choo Choo and Cha Cha have been saving their pocket money for many days. And their savings helped us buy this gift. Oh, my darlings. I'm so proud of you. What a thoughtful gift. Now my back won't hurt anymore. It's the best gift ever. From, From the, the best, best kids, kids ever. ever. was a warm, sunny summer morning. Choo Choo came out of the house and looked around the backyard. What a lovely day! I wonder what my friends and I can do to have fun today. I have an idea. I'll invite all my friends over to make a fort. And when it's done, we can call it the Happy Fort. Then we can sit inside the Happy Fort and do happy things. Choo Choo called all of her friends. They all came quickly. Everyone was excited. What are we going to do today, Choo Choo? We are going to make a fort. And we are going to call it the Happy Fort. And when it's ready, we'll sit inside it and do happy things. Cha-Cha, Chiku, and Chica like Choo Choo's idea. That sounds fun! We'll all help make the fort. But Cusley didn't want to participate. I don't want to make your fort, Choo Choo. I don't want to sit inside it either. I'll play my own game instead. Huh? Together, Choo Choo, Cha Cha, Chica, and Chiku made a wonderful happy fort. And they had a lot of fun doing it. <laughs> Cusley, however, didn't join them. Not even when the others asked him to. Join us, Cusley. Yes, Cusley. We're having fun. No. Huh? Cusley didn't join the others. And so Choo Choo and the other children made the fort on their own. Soon, it was ready. Our happy fort is ready! Let's sit inside it now and do happy things! Choo Choo, Cha Cha, Chiku, and Chica sat inside the fort. They played games and sang some happy songs. Let's pretend it's raining! Rain, rain, go away! Again another day Baby Taku wants to play Rain, rain, go away Yay! <laughs> huh? Sitting outside the fort Cusley noticed how much fun Choo Choo and the others were having Huh? My friends are having so much fun Huh? <sighs> I wish I had joined them and not been so rude. 
Choo Choo noticed Cusley looking disappointed. And so she suggested to the others that they invite Cusley to join them. Cha Cha? Chica? Chiku? I think Cusley's feeling left out. Let's invite him into our happy fort. Yes! Let's do that! We'd love to have Cusley in our happy fort. And so, Choo Choo, Cha Cha, Chica, and Chiku invited Cusley into the happy fort. Cusley? Please, join us in our happy fort. Come and play and do happy things with us. Huh? But I didn't help make it. Don't worry, Cusley. Come on in. Yes. Come and join the fun. So, Cusley joined his friends in the fort. Baking cakes. Pat a cake, pat a cake, baker's man. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Roll it and pat it and mark it with B. And put it in the oven for baby and me. Yay! <laughs> Cusley had a lot of fun playing in the happy fort. He was glad Choo Choo and the others had invited him in. That day, he decided that he would never be rude again and that he would join in whenever his friends invited him to do something fun. today because Mr. Harlow is taking us to a farm where we'll learn all about farm animals. I love animals. I'm sure you like animals too. So come with us because it's going to be a fun day. And oh, we're also going to sing a song about a farm with lots of funny animal sounds. Can you guess which one? Come on! So, are we ready to get on the bus and head for the farm? Yes, Mr. Harlow! Mr. Harlow, will there be cows at the farm? Chickens? And horses? Oh, yes. There will be cows and chickens and... Oh, no. It's raining. I hope it stops soon and doesn't ruin our plans. We can't go to the farm in the rain. Mr. Harlow, if it continues to rain, does that mean we can't go to the farm? I'm afraid so, Choo Choo. We'll probably have to plan our farm visit for another day. Oh no! I really want to go meet all the farm animals today. I've been thinking of this trip for so long. Oh, Choo Choo, I can understand how you feel. Tell you what, let's go wait in the classroom and hope the rain stops. Choo Choo. Won't you come and listen to some stories? No thanks, Miss Dorothy. I'm waiting for the rain to stop. So that we can go to the farm. I don't like to see you sad, Choo Choo. 
Maybe we could do something that makes Choo Choo happy. Singing! Choo Choo loves to sing! That's a great idea, kids! You make such kind and wonderful friends! Should we sing together, Choo Choo? Which song would you like to sing? Miss Dorothy, is it okay if we sing Rain Rain Go Away? Sure, Choo Choo! Come on, everybody! Rain, rain, go away! Come again another day! Little Choo Choo wants to play! Rain, rain, go away! Come again another day! Little Choo Choo wants to play! I feel a little happier after singing, Miss Dorothy. Great to hear that, Choo Choo. You know, when things don't go our way, when we feel disappointed, it always helps to do something that we enjoy. It usually cheers us up. Oh, the rain's coming down harder. We definitely can't go on our farm visit today. Aw, choo-choo. Miss Dorothy, I'm feeling disappointed. But I want to change this feeling. You said when we feel disappointed, we should do something that makes us happy. I want to try that, Miss Dorothy. That's a very positive attitude, Choo Choo. I'm so proud of you. And I have just the thing that can change your disappointment into fun. Close your eyes, everyone. I'll be right back with a surprise. Ta-da! It's here! A surprise egg! Open it! Open it, please, Mr. Harlow! It's my surprise farmyard egg! Harlow! Wow! So what if we can't go to the farm today? We can set up our own pretend farmyard and have fun! Let's set it up! Look, Chica! My cow is coming to say hello to your chickens! Moo! Cluck, cluck! Hello, Miss Cow! Oik, oik! Mr. Pig is feeling happy! Woof! Woof! Does anyone want a bone? Nay! Watch out! Here comes my horse! He's the strongest and he's going to eat up all the hay! Oh, Cusley! Look at you, Choo Choo! You're having so much fun! It's because you made me understand what we can do when we feel disappointed. Thanks, Miss Dorothy! You're welcome, Choo Choo! Oh! Should we sing Old MacDonald? Yes! yes! 